Like, guys, do I even want to talk about this game, man? Like, who gives a shit about this? Is this on the list? How many followers does this have? 400,000 now? Guys, why can I not load this page? Are they are they DDoSing this page here? <laughs> the Sweet Baby Ink Detected page. Ah, there we go. Wow, 400,000 followers, guys. Damn, almost half a million. Uh, recent reviews. Uh-huh. Ah, there we go. Not recommended. Read the full review. So, yeah, continue to external site. Mm -hmm. Dustborn. This is Dustborn from the perspective of Sweet Baby Ink Detected. You have been following Dustborn since last year and I recognize it took me so long to finally add it to the DEI detected list. But better late than never, right? True. Dustburn is basically DEI the game. <laughs> it has everything you could hope from a DEI game. Forced diversity, virtual signaging, self-insertions, woke political agenda being forced down the player's throat, a bunch of alphabet people and they thems. Nice. Dustborn. Meet the cast. Uh, okay. Okay, meet the cast. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. The game has very diverse set of characters, and you may ask if there's any straight white male among them. Of course there are villains. <laughs> of course. Of course, bro. He's frozen. His trigger's finger's frozen too. <laughs> oh my god. That's the best position for white male. <laughs> Oh, this image is great, man. I'm gonna put it on YouTube. Damn, bro. For some reason, he looks like JFK. What the fuck? <laughs> what did I tune into? Oh, man, this is great. It also features the most soy-filled combat mechanic I've ever seen. <laughs> you fight with the power of words. <laughs> oh, my God. Guys, can't we make friends, bro? Come on. We don't need to fight. Yes, in the game, words can hurt and the whole combat system revolves around this premise. They don't even try hiding it, do they? Wait, the caretaker. She slash her. Very important. No vocals, but in possession of something greater. A driver's license. Yes, the robot has pronouns. Oh my god. What is DEI? It is called diversity, equity, inclusion. Very important. Okay? You can Google it. The developers have also been proudly outspoken about their politically driven intentions with Dustborn. In an interview from way back in 2020, the Red Thread studio leader, Ragnar Tornquist, said this. We have a point of view with this game, Tornquist says. We are not stepping back and saying, you figure it out. We are basically saying, no, fascism is bad. But we also get go... Wait, wait. But we are also going to let our char characters argue about that. <laughs> the saddest part is that this game has been funded with tax money. I'm sorry, European bros. Oh, I'm so lucky. I don't need to pay taxes, guys. I don't earn enough to pay taxes. I would be mad. Oh, hell yeah, bro. Yeah, thank goodness I didn't pay this. Oh, my wife did, though. Fuck. My wife did. Shit. Oh my god. Co-funded by the Creative European Media Program of the European Union. No way in no way in Film Institute. Vican Film Film Center. Nonetheless, vote with your wallets. Which brings us to the game. Dustborn on Steam. It has <laughs> A staggering 84 reviews. 
Dustborn is great for narrative enjoyers. I love the character development of the character so far. It really feels like being part of a crew growing or going on a road trip. I love the art style as well. We can take a look at the charts. How the fuck does that happen? 84 people? Wait, how many people worked on this again? Dustborn? It is made by Red Thread Games. 15 team members. There we go. It was in our story, yeah. So it looks like, yeah, read about, essentially. It's the about section here. They have 15 team members and that's two people in there. I don't know why you would do something like this where the entire website is essentially just a fucking thin slice of nothingness. And then even if you scroll in, it literally blocks the text to be like this. Who reads text like this? Like, no wonder they can't make a game if they can't even make a proper website. website. Anyway, so it looks like 15 people made this. Um, yeah, looks like they are going to be uh, looking for a new job soon, huh? People are just tired of this, so I'm happy that this happens.